Another victim named as one of eight shootings linked to accused Stockton serial killer suspect Wesley Brownlee. Court documents reveal a murder charge tied to a killing in Oakland last year. CBS 13's Madison Keeney is getting answers about the investigation timeline and what has taken so long for charges. I couldn't imagine being in his situation, so I prayed for him. Natasha Latour, the only known survivor shot by accused serial killer Wesley Brownlee, spoke to us back in October outside of Brownlee's first court appearance. At that time, her attempted murder wasn't one of the charges. That changed this week. A San Joaquin County District Attorney's Office charged Brownlee with the murder of Mervyn Harmon in Oakland, a timeline of Brownlee's suspected killings. The first known victim on April 10th in Oakland last year, named in court docs as Juan Alexander Vasquez, previously identified as Juan Miguel Vasquez Serrano. The second victim, Mervyn Harmon, on April 16th, 2021, in Oakland. The same early morning, Natasha Latour's attempted murder in Stockton. The next killing in July of 2022, Paul Yaw shot in Stockton. The fifth victim on August 11th, Salvador Debedi Jr. in Stockton. More than a week later, on August 30th in Stockton, the sixth victim, Jonathan Hernandez Rodriguez. The seventh victim, Juan Cruz in Stockton on September 21st. The last known victim on September 27th, Lawrence Lopez, also identified as Lorenzo Lopez, killed in Stockton. Why did the five latest charges take more than a month to file after the first? A spokesperson for the DA's office in San Joaquin County told us there are multiple agencies involved and they only file charges when they can prove beyond a reasonable doubt. CBS 13 has also learned there may be more information revealed next week at Brownlee's arraignment on these latest charges. He's now facing 10 in all that is set for next Tuesday.